Hello everyone. And welcome to my channel. In this video I show you how to allow or prevent users. And groups from shutting down the system in Windows 10. Of course, each group in Windows has its own default rights. And permissions. When a user is a member of a group, the group's rights and permissions will be assigned to the user. In other words, Windows allows default users. And groups to shut down the computer. But if you want to prevent users from shutting down the computer, there is a simple way to do that. First, press Win key, plus R keys, to open Run, and in the Run box, type secpal.msc, then click the OK button. This command will open the Local Security Policy window. Then go to the left in Local Security Policy, and expand the Local Policies folder. Then, click on the User Rights Assignment folder, then go to the other side, and find Shut Down the System Policy, and double click on it to open it. After opening Shut Down the System Properties, you will find a list of those who are allowed to shut down the system, and to prevent users from shutting down, select the users, and then click the Remove button, then click the Apply, and OK button. Thus. You prevented users from shutting down the system in Windows. And you can close local security policy. To make sure, we will log out of the administrator account. And log in with a limited user account. Now, try to shut down the Windows system through this account. You will find that you can only shut down the system through the admin. And if you want to add users, or allow them to shut down the system in Windows, we will log out of the account, and we will log into Windows, with the administrator account again. Then, open the run box, and type secpal.msc, then, Click the OK button to open Local Security Policy, and expand Local Policies in the left pane. Then click on User Rights Assignment. On the other side, then double click on Shut Down the System Policy to open it. And click Add User or Group button. Then click on the Advanced button. And click the Object Types button. And check all the boxes for Object Types. And click the OK button. Then click Find Now. And select the username or group that you want to add. Then, click on the OK button. Then OK thus, the user's group was added again. Click Apply. And then OK. In this way, users were once again allowed to shut down the Windows system, through their limited accounts. You can make a computer restart to save these changes to the settings. I hope the video is useful to you. And thank you for watching. And I also hope to subscribe to my channel. Thank you all.